Hey students, in this video I'm going to show you how to get your CO2 dragster design ready to be printed in class. As you can see, I have a completed CO2 dragster design. It's actually pretty incomplete, but that's okay. I'm still going to get it ready for printing. First thing I want to do is actually have this project open. So there we have it. In previous steps of this assignment, you downloaded a template for a piece of paper from Schoology and then you moved it into your Google Drive. Hopefully you have those steps all set up. If you skipped those steps, pause the video, head back to Schoology and follow those steps. So we've got our template downloaded. We know where it's at in our Google Drive and we are going to be opening up that file. So I'm gonna to go to the word file. I'm gonna click on the word open and I'm gonna find my Google Drive. So I'm gonna to go to the top. I'm gonna to go to this PC. I'm gonna double click on the yellow folder for Google Drive. I'm going to double click on the yellow folder for my drive and then I'm going to wait for my drive to load. Remember your drive is going to load way faster if you have a cleaned up Google Drive. If you have a messy Google Drive, it will take forever to load. Now I'm going to double click on curriculum or no, sorry, I'm going to double click on distance learning. You're going to put, you're going to look in your folder where you have sorted it. I put mine in this distance learning folder and I put my next file into my CAD folder, which was part of your directions. Now I'm going to be opening up this one that has the little paper right here and I'm going to go to CO, or I'm going to go to Dragster Drawing Template. I'm going to select it and I'm going to click on open. The way this template was created, I have a little logo in there and every time I open up this file I have to resolve a link. It's super easy. All you do is click on the X in the top corner of that window. Now my new template will take a moment to load and bam, here it is. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to confirm that my dragster block is still open and then I'm going to go to my drawing, my dragster drawing. My drawing is blank except for a title block which is the lines around the outside and then some information in the bottom. Really easy to get your drawing set with your design. What you're going to do is go up to the top corner right below the word file and click on the tool base. When you click on base, a little box will open up and instantly it will say, hey, you've been working on this project. Do you have it open in the background? Is that the one you want to put on your plan? And you'll be like, yeah, it is. Then in your drawing view, you have a couple things that you have to set up before you do any more work. We have to change our scale from one half, which is always going to be the default, to one to one. So I'm going to set it up one to one. The reason we want it one to one is because we're going to be printing this out and then tracing it onto our block in class. So I put my plan in, boom, there it goes. Now I want my side view and just like we did on our paper drawing, I want my top view. So now I have both views. They are side by side. I don't need any other views. Notice that neither part of my view is touching these lines anywhere on the edge. Nothing is hitting this line as well. So I have my two views. All I need to do is click on OK. Now remember, Inventor does not automatically save. So I'm going to click on my little save icon and I am ready for the next step, which will be in our next video.